Welcome back. We are here looking at the cryptocurrency market, and this is going to be my daily forecast for Tuesday, December 1st, 2020. If you like to support our channel, you're welcome to hit the subscribe button down here in the corner, hit the like button and the bell button in order to see our newest videos, and you're welcome to join us over at Patreon, where you get access to our full technical analysis, our live and trades, and also our signal service. So the link is down below. You're welcome to join. So we're looking at Bitcoin and Bitcoin has been absolutely hammering it the last three days. I've added the 20 exponential moving average because I think it helps explain where we find the support levels for, for example, Bitcoin, the closest support levels at this stage. You can see that every single time we get close to the 20 exponential moving average, we have rallied. We never actually traded underneath the 20 exponential. We broke down towards it, broke above and stayed there. Then we broke down, uh, rallied a little bit, broke uh, below and then basically ended at the 20 exponential. And then we have been rallying ever since. We got to all the way up to 19,721 today before giving most of those gains back, ending at 19,140 at this, at this stage. Technical indicators for Bitcoin are looking fairly bullish. The CCI, Stochastic, are, have turned around. The RSI has fairly it turned around a little bit. It's not as bullish as these you know, both uh, indicators, but we are closing 70. But this is a market that can get all the way up to 90 in the RSI before it, Technically, any any uh, considering over overbought, but um, just keep in mind, under normal circumstances, seventy above seventy is considered overbought, and you should expect this to pull back. But this is a market that can go far higher than that before it technically gets dangerous to buy it. Uh, but we have had quite a uh, big pullback, so. It will be interesting to see. I actually think at this point we are going to rally further. If we manage to take out this top, then there's probably nothing that is uh, prohibiting this market from taking out these previous highs back in 2017, which is roughly 20,100. That is possible. Uh, I think that a lot of sellers will come in and try to pressure us down. So. If you look at this is the weekly chart and as you can see in the weekly chart we have been really parabolical with, with this growth we went all the way down from 3800 all the way up to 19500 or it give or take a little bit higher than that 90700 if you look at technical years for other for the, for the weekly chart then there then the rsi is significantly overbought and most of these indicators are not as bullish as they are for the daily chart. And that is saying something because the stochastic is flat. The CCI is negative. We are overbought and we only need the MACD to turn around here. And that will probably be the sign that that is, is going to say we are going towards 15,000. Because 15,000 is most likely where we'll catch up with the uh, 20 exponential moving average in this chart and then we can go higher from there. I don't expect this market to break down all the way to the 200 moving average as it did back in 2017. That is not what I'm looking for. I'm looking for a breakdown towards the 15 and a rally there is an indication that we are going to go higher. So at this point, yes, if we have a pullback, then most likely our pullback will find support here at 17,000, uh, roughly 466. If that breaks, then watch out below. We are most likely going towards the 50 moving average, which is roughly at 15,000 at this stage. And there is going to be a lot of support in this market. So let's look at Ethereum. We can see that it is uh, it, almost the same, uh, same story. The 20 exponential, is basically where we have been finding these uh, support levels. So we never broke down below the, the fifth uh, or traded below the 20 exponential in the last week. We hit it, rallied, and now we are basically at the same stage 
or almost at the previous highs here at 607 is basically where we hit the day. So if we can manage to take out this top at the 624, then we are going much higher in this market. And there is room to the upside. This is also under the cryptocurrency and we are at 68 at this point in RSI. It can go all the way up to 80, 90 before uh, a red warning sign is basically showing that this is overbought. This is a cryptocurrency market and it is... It is, um, well, it's a, they take risk, apparently. Somebody is willing to buy this when it's basically over 70. Uh, so, so um, yeah. But if we break down from here, then you should find support at 511. If we break below that, then we have the 50 here at 441. But these previous highs here should offer a lot of support. So don't expect this to go further than 481. That's also where we... Uh, found uh, support um, on Friday's session. So we need to put a pullback towards the 20. If that is a support, then it's possible to buy, but otherwise I'm going to stay away from this. So hope you find this video helpful. You are welcome to support our channel by subscribing. Hit the like button and the bell button in order to see our newest videos. And you're welcome to join us over at Patreon. Well, you get access to our signal service and our live trades and our full technical analysis. So, good luck and thank you very much.